Of the 80 staff members, 67 teachers and nine administrators have been told that they won't have a job here in Mount Healthy next school year. The district says it made that decision after looking at the district's operational and financial stability. Now they say their five year forecasts indicated they were going to move into deficit spending. In February, the Mount Healthy Board of Education asked the state to immediately put the district into fiscal emergency. In a statement posted to Facebook, the district says that measure would make sure the staff was paid. It would also allow the state to look at the district spending and help make necessary cuts. Superintendent Dr. Valerie Hawkins released a statement today about the staff cuts. She said, quote, we understand the impact that this decision has on our staff members and their families. The district remains committed to supporting our employees throughout this transition. I talked to a former Mount Healthy High School teacher. He says these cuts are devastating. It's already challenging enough. And now with the class sizes obviously going to get much bigger and with these cuts, it's, I, I don't know how it's, I don't know how they're going to handle it. I really don't. District administrators say they're helping those 80 staff members find new jobs. I did reach out to the Mount Healthy Teachers Association president. She told me they had no comment at this time. The district also declined an interview. Reporting in Mount Healthy, Chelsea Sick, back to you. You can always find our local 12 stories right here on YouTube. Don't forget to tap subscribe and then you can get all the notifications.